Hey guys, welcome to your love reading uh, for Leo, uh, for your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for January 2023. So we're going to take a look at the person that you're dealing with or the person that you're thinking of, what they're hiding from you, what they're not telling you, and then we'll finish off the read to see uh, if they will come clean or that if you will find out on your own. So apply this to your own unique situation, even though this is love, this could be with anybody, okay? Friends, family members, co-workers. Um, uh, you also could switch the roles if you want. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, take a look at your other placements. If you guys haven't done so yet, hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post. Give this video a thumbs up, like this video, share this video, leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonates. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective Leo people not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. So if you're looking for a reading tailored to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you book a private personal reading with me. The uh, link for that is in the description box below. Okay, tell me about uh, Leo here. The person that Leo is dealing with or the person that Leo has on their mind? What is this person not telling Leo? What is this person hiding from Leo for January 2023? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Leo. We have the world. This person might, might be at a distance from you. This could be a long distance relationship here. We have the four swords in the reverse. Okay, so what we have here, I feel like there's a situation that Perhaps you took a break from this person, okay? This person took a break from you, but I feel like they could be coming around with some sort of communication here with you, for, uh, with you. all right? We have the Seven of Cups. The Three of Swords just flipped out and then flips back in. We have the Seven of Cups here and the Five of Cups. I, I feel like this person made a mistake in exploring options here or going to the other side of the grass here, and I feel like this person regrets it, yeah. This person regrets it so much. I feel like this person had to run off to be on their own, to do some, uh, you know, to do some, uh, to take some time out to really realize this. We have the Queen of Swords here, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. Yeah, I do feel like someone here is definitely coming back around to speak with you, okay? Someone here is definitely coming in confidently to speak with you here. They have something to get off their chest here. Oh, wow. What they're hiding from you is that, you know, they want to tell you that they want a life here with you. Okay? With the three a Ten of Cups here and the Knight of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. Oh, this is so interesting. One of the things I'm getting here is that it could be a situation where it could be a same-sex couple. Or, or it, it could be something of, of the same sex here where this person that you're dealing with here hasn't come out of the closet yet and they feel like this person's coming in to lay everything out on the table to you know come out of the closet and tell you that they want to be with you because i feel like this person you know could have you know been experimenting with you or something like that but at the same time they were seeing other people of an opposite sex here i'm feeling like it's a like a guy on guy sort of thing here but just apply this to your own unique situation that might just apply to one of you guys okay tell me about the seven of cups here we have the king of pentacles capricorn taurus virgo five of cups and the fool card here aries energy yeah i just feel like someone here feels like they made a foolish mistake here okay i feel like someone here is being honest trying to uh, honor you know what they're feeling here okay sort of like honor themselves sort of like live their true authentic life here okay um i feel like that king of pentacles is you so i feel like this person is fantasizing about you you know daydreaming about you made a mistake here queen of swords we have the page of wands here aries little sag the six of wands here in the tower now, let's say this is a friend or something like that, and someone here is coming out of the closet. You know, this friend might be telling you, oh my God, I think I am gay and I'm falling for you. You know, that could be, you know, them dropping a huge bombshell on you. The Tower, Aries, Scorpio energy. I mean, it could be guy on guy, it could be female on female. So like I said, apply this to your own unique situation here. Page of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag, the Tower here, Aries, Scorpio. What else do we have here for Leo? What else do we have here for Leo? Will this person come clean towards Leo for January 2023? Sun, moon, rising, Venus signs. I feel like this person will. Yeah, especially with the 
Queen of Swords and the uh, Knight of Swords here. We have this Ace of Cups. We have the Knight of Cups, yeah. I feel like this this person definitely will. Uh, Ace of Cups, us, yeah. So the Ace of Cups, Knight of Cups, Ace of Pentacles here, and the Six of Cups. This is a friend that you've known for a long time. And I feel like I feel like this is like a coming out of the closet reading here because I just feel like, you know, this is something you might have suspe suspected here, but, you know, I feel like this is going to blow your mind, okay, in a way. But it's kind of like not too surprising, but it's going to be shocking, okay? Ace of Pentacles here in the Six of Cups. We have the Temperance card, Sagittarius Energy and the Ten of Wands. Oh, this person's, this this weight that they've been carrying around with them, it's, you know, I feel like they're going to feel a sense of relief here because I feel like this is something that they've been keeping to themselves for a very, 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 very long time. Ace of Pentacles here in the Six of Cups. Whoever this is, this person is falling in love with you. I do feel like this is someone that you thought is, that is your friend and they're coming out. Yeah. Ten of Wands here. Temperance, Sagittarius, Energy, Ten of Wands. Um, so tell me about the uh, Ace of Cups, Knight of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. We have the Chariot here, Cancer, Energy, the Knight of Cups here, and the Devil. Wow. You know, I feel like in a way they're also facing their demons here too. Yeah. I mean, this person was definitely wearing a mask for a very, very, very long time. And that mask is coming off here. This person is freeing themselves from this Devil energy here. Tell me about this Ace of Pentacles. I feel like this person, you know, did not come clean you know, because of perhaps, you know, uh, this person comes from like a very rigid traditional family and this person couldn't. But I just feel like there's an energy of definitely bursting at the seams here, okay? We have the star card, the six of cups and the knight of pentacles. Yeah, this person's definitely coming with the offer here, coming with, with the message here. I mean, this, I mean, this is really gonna blow, this is really gonna blow your socks off here, Leo. That's what I'm feeling, yeah. But I, I feel like you also feel something for this friend here too, you know? So the star card, Aquarius Energy, the Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Tell me about the Temperance card here. Three of Wands, Ten of Wands, and the Two of Wands. It's kind of like they've been waiting for the right time here. Or that this person does not want to wait around, you know? And, 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 and sort of like, you know not live their life authentically here you know i just feel like this person's definitely having a lot of perspective here they're having some sort of aha moment okay it's sort of like they're letting it you know they're really letting go and really surrendering just kind of like you know saying what they have to say speaking their truth here okay so leo hope this was helpful hope this uh, resonated if it did leave a comment down in the comment section below share this video like this video if you haven't done so yet subscribe Hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.